With service comes sacrifice. With sacrifice, separation. Before the joys of homecoming, there is the sorrow of departure. The following is a short count test of the 1FC conductor from secondary comp. 1, 2, 3, 3, 2, 1, test complete. Welcome aboard. Uh, we're glad to have you here on Harry S. Truman. Uh, I will tell you that we've gone to great lengths uh, and have received the best training in the world to conduct prompt and sustained combat operations at sea. We're a versatile force. We're very flexible. And, you know, that, that's what the value to the nation is. You know, we are, we are a barometer of national resolve. We are going to go where it's most important for our nation to send us, uh, and, and if that, anywhere around the globe. And we don't need a permission slip to operate there. So uh, that's the value that we bring, and we take great pride in that. So our mission as we go out, we are to deliver combat operations from the sea. Uh, we'll be there in due time and execute our mission successfully, and we hope that brings some peace of mind to the folks that are out there, both our coalition partners as well as our troops on the ground. And then it brings that hard to swallow aspect in the, in the faces and in the minds of a deliberate pause in our enemy. I think about Harry S. Truman being a very resilient president, and I truly believe that's the crew we have. Uh, the buck stop here means a lot to this crew, and we would never let the resiliency die. Know that each and every one of them, you know, raised their right hand and swore an oath before God during a, a time of war to be part of this team, and they've all earned their spots, okay? We couldn't do it without the support of the, the families that'll be waiting back here. So they're the unsung heroes, they're the ones that enable us to do that, uh, do the things that we do. So please, thank, thank the families for us and all that they do. Thanks for your support, and uh, we, we, look, we look forward to going. There's not a, a place on the planet I would rather be than, than right here on this ship today. I am out here to support my husband. Um, he's been in the Navy for 11 years, and this is our fourth deployment. Actually, it's been a little hard at this time. I have the four kids. Um, but each day, one thing I did learn from the last deployment was each day is a day closer to seeing him. Each minute is a minute closer as well. actually saying goodbye to my husband for however long, Kevin Henry, he's one of the corpsmen on the ship. It was real hard because um, we weren't expecting him to deploy so quickly because he just transferred to the ship. So it was kind of like we had like four weeks to prepare for him to leave. You're going to be a little saddened because you're away from family, especially during the holiday season. Um, and then you're away from football game, basketball game, school. Uh, we celebrated Thanksgiving early and did some Christmas early because they're going to be gone during those holidays. Just spent a lot of family time together. I'm very proud of him. He is a very strong person. This is the job he signed up for and to protect the country, fight for the country, and I'm here to support him. Um, I'm here to see my sister get deployed. She's uh, been in the Navy for a year and a half. Um, she has been one of my biggest inspirations and someone I look up to very much. She's the bigger sister and I love her to death and everything she's done, it's just totally amazing. So proud of her. Oh, it's awesome. You know, never, uh, I mean, this is a great opportunity for, my, you know, this is my last deployment, his first full deployment, and this is a great opportunity to be together as a uh, father and son and watch him grow in the Navy and, 
and serve our country? Uh, I'm not quite sure. I was <laughs> I was in high school and I was lost. I didn't know what I was going to do, so I gave it a shot and here I am. I couldn't be more proud of my son. I couldn't be pr more proud of my husband. Uh, he's been here, done this for a long time now, so I feel like any problems that arise or, you know, any praises that he is, are happening that, you know, I'll hear it straight from the big guy here, and I am extremely proud of both of them. Serving our country is, is, is awesome. I think a lot of times, you know, we can forget about what it really means and how our country is not free and then what we're doing for it right now and, and, and to have fun, you know, this, this was about traveling and seeing the world also. And, and it's an excellent, it's an awesome opportunity for anybody out there that's in the military. Um, being apart from family is hard and never gets easier, even though this is like number 12, 13 deployment for me. Um, and, and stay strong in, in your faith and, uh, you know, and always do keeping busy education on the ship. I mean, there's a lot to offer on board and, and, and just to, to have fun and, and continue to grow in the Navy. More homecoming after the break. <laughs>